welcome to a week in my life. I am so cozy and bundled up right now. It is quite chilly in Florida. Let's see how cold it is for reference. And again, this is a very relative term for us Floridians. Cold is a lot different for us than it is for people of North. It's currently 43 degrees, so. It's chilly, I'm under my heated blanket, just in my quiet time, but I'm so excited to be filming a week in my life video this week. It's only gonna be Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday because it's already Tuesday. Yesterday was MLK Day, and so Brandon and I didn't work in observance of it, which was really nice and a great day. And then Friday, we have something really exciting happening, and I'm gonna do a separate vlog for it, so you'll see that soon, but that's why I'm only doing Tuesday. Wednesday and then Thursday, but I'm sure it'll be jam-packed and we'll have lots of fun hanging out the next few days. So this weekend was really special because I got baptized. It was so incredible and Brandon was actually able to baptize me. So it was so, so sweet. I'll insert a little clip of it here. And I've had like a strong faith for most of my life, but I never got baptized. So it was a really special thing to do at my church and it was really meaningful. And now we just are stepping into the week and today I have a lot, a lot, a lot of a work meetings. So I need to check my calendar and see what time they start because I can't remember on the top of my head what time they begin. And then my friend, she's coming over to have some coffee and just catch up. And then Brandon will be home and I'm going to make some ramen for dinner tonight, which I just posted in Allison's Eats video where I shared how I make my vegetarian spicy garlic ramen. And that's what I'm gonna make again tonight because I don't feel like going to the grocery store today because there's nothing that we need. Oh, and also before I start my meetings this morning, I want to clean our apartment. Um, not do a deep cleaning by any means, but just vacuum and sweep and maybe Swiffer in the kitchen and bathroom because I haven't done that in a while. And I also need to clean our appliances because we have like stainless steel appliances but they get like fingerprints and whatnot, so I'm gonna like wipe those down. So I'll probably like put in a mu some music or a podcast and get that done. But that's kind of the plan for today. And like I said, it's gonna be a work heavy day and week, but of course we'll squeeze in some fun and, and I'm excited to spend time with you. my day kind of planned out and time blocked I get a lot of questions on how I change the colors in my Google Calendar and basically you have to just create different calendars with different colors so I have like my personal one which is just Allison and then I have my Disney work calendar and I made the color blue and then I have my Instagram calendar and then I have travel and then I have YouTube. So I just made it a different color for each one and to change the colors, you just click that and then you can add a custom color and that's how you can make it all nice and pretty. And right now I'm also sitting down to plan my YouTube videos for the week. So I have this like big list of all the videos I want to make and the highlighted ones are the ones that I already did. And so now I'm just looking at my calendar and the weeks to come and I'm gonna plan it. to clean and get stuff done but I'm so cozy on the couch with my coffee which I always take literally like five hours to drink my morning coffee but I've got the heated blanket on literally the highest degree so I'm so 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 warm and I just do not feel like cleaning at all
clean and I wanted to show you guys the cute little cactus I got yesterday. I went to the cactus farm with my friend Haley and snagged this cutie. I still need to get him a little pot, but oh my goodness. I think he's just the cutest thing. I'm wrapped up in the heated blanket again. Thank goodness. That was my reward for cleaning. But oh my goodness, my cramps are just crippling me quite a bit today. But I do have a lot of work I really want to get done. So I'm trying to think of like what can make me more comfortable. Of course, like my blanket's helping me. I don't want to take a painkiller because I actually took two yesterday. Um because it was super, like way worse than it is today. So, and I don't love to take pain killers. I try to avoid them because I just like don't believe it's good for my body. Of course, every once in a while it's fine, but I, I like want to be strong too. <laughs> so I might make some tea or something or have some orange juice actually. That sounds really good. Like some ice orange juice. I think I'm gonna go do that and then we are going to start on my Disney work because I have a lot of tasks that I need 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 to get done this week because last week my work computer was actually broken for like three days so I'm really behind and need to be productive <laughs> There's a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth All right, it's time for a little lunch break. So I just have a side of veggies, cucumbers, and carrots. And then I have this leftover pasta, which is so convenient to have. It's just a veggie pasta um, with olive oil. And I have green beans in there and some garlic. And I just put some oregano and Parmesan cheese and red pepper flakes and ground black pepper. Super yummy. And it's nice that it's warm. But I just realized I will be having pasta for lunch and then ramen noodles for dinner. So it's a very pasta heavy day. finished all my work meetings and I'm feeling incredibly overwhelmed it's gonna be okay I know I know everybody has these moments in these days and stuff but it's just like ugh, I'm PMSing also so any little thing just like meltdown but yeah it definitely gets hard to juggle everything sometimes but I really am so thankful for both of my jobs um so I never like want to lose sight of my gratitude and thankfulness and I know it's all going to work out and my coworkers are amazing. It's just everyone is so busy and I want to help out as much as I can. But of course I'm busy too with this whole thing, the YouTube world and um, just navigating all of that. It just definitely is overwhelming sometimes and Brandon and I have a lot of life stuff going on. So just a busy time and I really don't like the word busy that much because I feel like it's a very negative word and I am so guilty of using it a lot and I feel like every time I complain about being busy I'm complaining about like blessings in my life like my amazing jobs that I that are my dream jobs and you know my amazing personal life and you know the great friends I have time to hang out with even though sometimes I feel like I don't have time you know so I really have been like challenging myself trying not to use those words but sometimes it just like really I guess overwhelming is an okay word but I just have to just start crossing things off and then I'll feel so much better but my friends my, excuse me, my friend Katie is about to come over. So I'm going to make us some coffee now. going to have a little coffee break. And then Brandon probably will need to work on some grad school stuff tonight. So that'll be good. I can kind of work while he's doing his grad school. Life is a winding road. No telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights. Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs 
say I lost my mind. I will keep Good morning. Today I am feeling, I, I sound and look very tired, but I am actually feeling so motivated. I woke up like energized and ready to just tackle everything. I feel like I was so whiny yesterday. I am sorry about that. Again, I never want to whine or complain about the blessings in my life, but I was just feeling overwhelmed and behind because of my whole computer situation last week, but we are getting stuff done. I've been working for Disney and getting some stuff done ever since I finished my quiet time this morning, so I've been working for about an hour and a half now. It's like 7.15 right now, um, so I'm really knocking things out. And I got to go grocery shopping later, so I'll probably leave for that around 10 because um, I'd like to just wrap up a few things, go grocery shopping, get a coffee, and then finish the rest. That's kind of like my plan. I'm not going to do like any YouTube stuff today besides answer a couple emails and of course vlog, but I'm really going to focus on my Disney work today to really just knock it out and catch up from last week. So that feels good and I'm just praying that I stay this motivated and energized and I don't get distracted because we don't have time for that today. Okay, so you kind of already saw Brandon's breakfast that I made earlier this morning, but I'm making myself banana peanut butter oatmeal as well. I do make mine a little different than his though. I like to add chia seeds, so I just kind of like dump a few. I like a lot, honestly. So he doesn't, he doesn't love them, so I don't add them to his oatmeal. And then I also add peanuts to mine, just a little though, because the peanut butter we have is crunchy, so it already has some peanuts. Oh my, that kind of came out a little quicker. And then I also add some honey. So that's all I do for mine is just oatmeal, banana, peanut butter, peanuts, and then chia seeds and honey. But Brandon, he likes raisins in his, which I am just not a fan of raisins. They didn't do anything to me. I just am not that big of a fan, but I do like the chia seeds instead. And then I just washed, I washed these strawberries with my fruit and vegetable wash. So I'm gonna eat some of them now. Oh my goodness, I love strawberries so much. This is my super yummy breakfast. iPhone. Okay, I'm off to Walmart to do the grocery shopping and I'm bundled up because it's 40 degrees outside and you know how I feel about being cold. So <laughs> this is what I'm wearing. I've been wearing this sweatshirt and these leggings for like 42 hours now. I did shower last night but then I just changed it to the same exact clothes I was wearing because they're just the warmest things. So yeah, but here we go. Gonna conquer the cold and our grocery list. Look at all these cute little succulents that my Walmart has. Five for $10. Okay, I am actually really impressed with their garden selection. Like they have these plant stands. It doesn't come with the pot, but it's like this pretty gold plant stand for six bucks. I need a pot that's in between this size and that size, but unfortunately, I don't really see anything. A second, this could be perfect. And it's only 250. Oh my goodness, and it's new. I want to get that. I want to get that. I want to get these. Walmart and I also got a latte, an iced latte. I'm pretty sure I ordered a hot one because it's freezing but he gave me an iced one and I'm just like it's still gonna be delicious and I'm just not in the mood to like wait for them to make another one and it's I like was deciding which one I wanted more. I wasn't married to the hot one so no biggie but yeah I'm gonna drink that later give me some more fuel but my Walmart greeter is like the sweetest older gentleman ever. It makes my day when he's working so it was a pretty good 
Walmart grocery run, but I am not looking forward to climbing up to my apartment with like 100 pounds of groceries. Probably even more, because we get so many groceries. So it's always like such a trek to get them all up to our apartment. We have an elevator, but I like refuse to take it. It's my workout for the day. <laughs> So cute it's such a perfect size but my little cactus isn't sitting flat because he has some roots growing out the bottom so I don't really know what to do and I don't have like rubber gloves to pull him out and I already got like his little prickles on me I'll show you in the light do you see those little hairs it's that's the prickles so I need to tweezer them out. It doesn't hurt, it's just like stuck on my skin. But yeah, I really like the pot a lot. I think it was a great fit and great buy, but I don't have potting soil to like unpot him. I guess, I think I'm just gonna try to take him out. I can use like some tongs and then I'm gonna place him in the bottom of the pot and hope it works okay. warmth but also to kind of diversify my outfit because I'm about to go into a meeting and I totally wore the same thing yesterday for my meeting but the hat and scarf is a new addition to my outfit so I'm kind of an outfit repeater but I don't think anyone will notice <laughs> okay Brandon got home like 45 minutes ago and he was trying to convince me to go to the gym with him but I was like in the middle of work and I was like a little crabby because I was just like in the middle and focused and he was like go to the gym go to the gym but he went to the gym and I just wrapped up my work and I looked up this like um I do not feel like leaving my apartment again so I just looked up this little booty workout that I can do I can do a 10 minute one or a 20 minute one so I think I'm gonna do the 20 minute oh there we go um, and I'm just gonna do that at home because I really like I do want to work out But I don't want to take that much time because I want to get dinner ready because I am hungry It's only like 4 30, but I could eat a whole dinner right now So I'm just gonna do this and start cooking and then I'll get my little workout, but oh my goodness He's I'm the worst gym buddy for Brandon ever <laughs> Amazing. I feel so good. That's like just what I needed. Um, but like I said, it was a booty workout and I just found it on YouTube. I literally just Googled booty workout and then it's by Pamela Reef. Um, but I'll link it down below. But that was such a good workout. Like I'm sweating and it, it takes a lot for me to sweat, honestly. And my apartment's 60 degrees. <laughs> like that's how you know it was a good workout. So I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna ponder in the shower, but I wanna like put together a more concrete workout routine for me because I do work out like three to four times a week, but I don't have any sort of plan. It's usually just like what I feel like doing. And I feel like when I go to the gym, I'm kind of a lost puppy still, no matter like how hard I try, but this is like having a personal trainer. It's like yoga with Adrian. Like they tell you exactly what to do and they have it all timed out, so. I'm gonna try to do this every other day and I'm gonna look at the other workouts she has. Oh, she has a 10 minute six pack workout. Let's go. <laughs> so I'll let you go, I'll let you guys know. Like I'll keep you updated on what I like establish for my routine, but wow. It, it really did just give me so much energy by doing that workout. Hello friends, 
Look who put on some makeup and did their hair and got dressed for work. I am leaving my apartment today. I know it's a miracle. Actually, I did leave yesterday too, but I'm going to work. I'm actually going to a Disney resort because we have like a big ballroom booked for um, a large team meeting. So I'm headed to the Disney's Yacht and Beach Club Resort. I'm gonna park there and they have lunch for us and then we're gonna have the meeting. It's an hour and a half meeting. So after that, I'm actually headed back here. I have one more meeting after that, but it's not until three. And the meeting, the, the person who is in charge of the meeting and talks the most is on the West Coast. So we just all do it virtually. So I might as well just come back here. So I'm gonna do that. And then after that, Brandon will be home and then we're gonna go to Epcot with a couple of our friends. So that'll be great. It'll be like a triple date. Get to hang out with them and get out. Brandon and I are gonna go a little early. They're not gonna meet us until around seven or 6.30. So we're gonna go a little early, have a little date. Ugh. This week, it's been two, it's been the shortest week ever because I'm only working Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, but it's felt like it's been seven days. I've just been going, 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 but it's been a good week. I'm just feeling a little like low energy. So I'm gonna get that energy up. It'll be nice to kind of get out and see some people and kind of feed off their energy, but it's gonna be a good day. I did want to share my outfit. So I am wearing this just black turtleneck. It's from Forever 21. It's actually a turtleneck dress. It kind of looks like a bodysuit, but it's a turtleneck dress that I just kind of tucked into my pants. And these are from Express, but I just checked and unfortunately they are sold out. So I won't link them below because that'll just be a disappointment to you. Um, but I am going to do a video with them soon and I ordered a couple other work pants so I'll show you those soon and then I'm just wearing these black booties from Just Fab and I'm going to also take this jacket that's from Princess Polly just to kind of keep me extra warm because you know I'm a baby. I haven't even tried that on yet. I might wear that or I'll wear my pink blazer. Maybe a little more professional. <laughs> Boardwalk Yacht and Beach Club. Oh, there's the microwave because I'm making some afternoon coffee. Um, but the meeting was incredible. It was so, so inspiring. Um, it was just a team meeting with like the top executives. So they actually pulled in the director of marketing for Disney Plus and that was just everything to me. He talked about so many of the films and projects that they worked on and just the whole marketing thought process and creative thought process that went into the release of Disney Plus. So super fascinating and interesting. So that's really got me riled up and ready to go and tackle the rest of my work for today. But yeah, I'm just gonna make some afternoon coffee. It's rainy, so I am getting cozy. I got rained on a little bit, but it was just like spitting rain. It's not pouring or anything, but Brandon should be home shortly and I have my meeting at three and then going back to Disney. <laughs> to leave for Disney. I changed to just my little um, loungewear set from Boohoo. It is so incredibly comfy and I just want to be comfy and warm because it's still kind of chilly. Thankfully it's not raining anymore but it is super cloudy. But I stuck on some mini ears naturally and a coat and Brandon he's finishing up his dinner. Say hi. <laughs> and then we'll leave. But I'm going to sign off now, but I hope you enjoyed this week in my life video. It was only three days long, but it was a long, short week. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm so thankful for you and can't wait to see you super soon. Bye. Jumping from cliffs so high, trusting our wings to fly. Sometimes we're crashing down.